time Millwall and Crystal Palace faced off with each other was nearly nine years ago in the Championship. Today should be a bit of a different one. Yes, lads, it's Subian Talks Foot here. And in today's video, South East London is calling for Millwall versus Crystal Palace in the third round of the FA Cup. Form goes out the window because for Millwall and Crystal Palace, Gary Rowett's Lions in the Championship are on a very, very hot and cold run of form. They could pick up a huge win or a huge loss at any given moment. And let me tell you, Vieira's Palace are pretty much exactly the same. They could find a huge win out of nowhere and then they could go and stumble against one of the lesser teams. You never really know. But today, all form is forgotten in a derby which has one thing. Passion, passion and passion. That's three. But you get what I mean. The atmosphere of the den will shine through today. And my aim to you when making this video is to show you that the Den faithful are so, so often the 12th man. Millwall fans get slated for being violent, but no, they just love their club and that is what we're going to show you today. My score prediction is Millwall 2, Crystal Palace 1, the Den boys will be the 12th man and back on the Lions to victory and send them into the fourth round. The scenes, if they win against Palace today, it's just going to be simply unbelievable. I cannot bloody wait for it. What a day we have in store. I'm going to miss the train. Let's head down to South East bloody London. Here we go. Unbelievable! Uh, 
Williams at the den. Millwall leads. Unbelievable. They deserve it so, so much. They've been going at it from minute one. Right, Millwall chips here about 10 minutes before half time. Let's dig in. Very potato y. 8.5 out of 10. Three added minutes at the end of this first half, which I have to say, Millwall dominated from start to finish. Palace have not looked like scoring one single bit. It's all the home side from the den. And it's absolutely brilliant. Is there time for one last Millwall attack in this first half? Ginger not heads it away. No, and there we go. There is the half half whistle at the den. Very gladly welcomed by the Millwall faithful. What a half of football that was. Robert, sum that up in two words. Yeah, good football. Good football. Yeah, don't wait, yeah. <laughs> All, all over Palace in that first half. The Eagles did not have a sniff, and as it stands, Millwall are into the fourth round. What a half that was! Bring on the second half. This place is buzzing. Here we go. Second half, ready to get back underway. And the then should be a cracker once again. Bring it on. Here comes Michael Elise for Palace. fans in fine voice now but one thing Millwall can't let that goal do is get to their heads and put them down they have to keep pushing and pushing for a third goal in this game because I think the next goal in this is a winner I'm sure you can hear the Palace fans in the background they are noisy aren't they but Millwall better than them and I'll prove that now there's the goal scorer Tricky number seven, Michael Elise. What a player he is and what a goal that was. Here comes Elise again. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Literally a carbon copy. Just hit the outside of the post. This isn't good. Oh my goodness. Elise again. Elise again. How many times is he going to cut in? Oh my god. Here come Palace again. Elise again on the right hand side. Ball in.
don't believe what I'm witnessing. I do not believe it. Got about eight and a half minutes left of normal time at the den. There is still time for normal to get the goal back. And I have to say, if there's going to be a fourth, they are the most likely to get it. It's just not happening for them at the moment. But they need to find a goal from somewhere to take this to extra time. Five minutes of added time for Millwall to get an equaliser. This place will erupt if that happens. Keep the faith. Keep the faith. Go on. Oh! That's the last chance. That is the last chance. Horrible. Palace. I've done it. They've surely done it now.